Recently, we designed a high graphic machine with Intel Core i9 processor 11th generation. So, I want to discuss something about processor. Actually, basically, processor is the electronic chip which having billions of transistors. But do you think ever why only transistor use in processor? Rather, other electronic components are available. So you have to learn first transistor property. Transistor is a semiconductor device which we can use transistor for amplifying, controlling and generating electronic signal. So Intel already introduced 3D Trigates transistor. When we choose processor for our organization, generally we see and care about processor much. Generally, during selection of, of processor of for our system, we see and care about cores, cache memory, and maximum to maximum CPU generation like 9 generation, 10 generation, 11 generation. But today I will give you different angle different angle to understand processor these are lithography thermal design power tdp means frequency and cpu integrated like gpu graphic memory first we understand what is lithography lithography is the refer semiconductor technology or chip dia like 12 nm 14 nm 22 nm you can say much smaller size of processor much high level processing because number of transistor will be there number of transistors are increased According Moore law, number of transistors on a microchip doubles every two years and size of the chip will reduce. It directly means processor speed high due to increased number of transistors. So 11th generation processor come with rocket leg 14 nm means lithography size is 14 nm. So you can well, we should keep in the mind lithography size, size is reduced and transistor number of transistor size number of transistor increase. Second is frequency, yes we should keep the mind to select processor frequency. Frequency means how quickly CPU can retrieve and interpret instructions, high frequency CPU can high data retrieve and interpret instructions it's actually two types base frequency and turbo boost frequency difference between base frequency and turbo boost frequency should not be much you should mind this when you see specification cpu 11900 and 11900T both are Core i9 but technical specification little different CPU 11900 base frequency is 2.5 and turbo boost 5.2 gigahertz and 11900T base frequency is 1.5 and 4.9 gigahertz so we sell, I select CPU Delver 900 because its base frequency and turbo boost frequency difference is low but cost may be little high incurred but now we are here we would not talk about cost we discuss only technical specification how we choose our processor for our system third is tdp 
इट्स थर्मल डिजाइन पावर इट मीन्स पावर कंजम्पन अंडर द मैक्सिमम थियोटिकल लोड पर्पज टू सी दिस कंपोनेंट इज प्रोवाइड सिस्टम डिजाइनर एंड इंटीग्रेटर विद प्रॉपर थर्मल सोल्यूशन थर्मल सोल्यूशन इज इम्पोर्टेंट लाइक सी पी यू सी पी यू थर्मल सिक्सटी फाइव वॉट और थर्टी फाइव वॉट तो वी शुड की दिस थिंग टी डी पी एंड फोर्थ लास्ट बट नॉट लीस्ट जी पी यू इंटीग्रेटेड ग्राफिक मेमोरी और प्रोसेसर जी पी यू मीन्स ग्राफिक प्रोसेसिंग यूनिट इट्स इंटीग्रेटेड ग्राफिक्स डिजाइन बाई सी पी यू मैन्युफैक्चर लाइक इंटल एंड एम एम डी इंटल ऑलरेडी इंट्रोड्यूस यू एस डी ग्राफिक सेवन फिफ्टी इन इलेवन जनरेशन यह ऑलरेडी इंट्रोड्यूस आईरिस एक्सी इंटल एस डी तो इन इलेवन जनरेशन प्रोसेसर इंटल इंट्रोड्यूस यू एस डी ग्राफिक सेवन फिफ्टी इट इम्प्रूव शेडर काउंट लीड एंड बिग लीप इन ग्राफिक्स परफॉर्मेंस If our integrated graphic memory is more rational, तो graphic threads solve very easily by processor and support up to the resolution 3840 by 2160p. So it's very important component GPU. These a core cache memory and generation it's also important because it's very important component but three components also important tdp gpu lithography so be a real true hardware engineer and uh, true administrator so you should sharp your tier of selection of cpu it's the mind of our system if we select right processor because processor is depend entire structure of system if your processor support ddr4 ram and how much higher capacity of frame on the board it depend on the processor it's 64 bit processor 32 bit processor now it all 11 generation 64 bit processor it's not doesn't mind but everything every component we should know as per our job towards our organization so be real and true hardware engineer dive in your profession and sharp your tier of selection of hardware that's it today